going on everyone i got a sorcery beta box here from one of the first rudy uh i guess it's kits from back earlier in 2023 uh not the 2024 kit so i bought all three from someone of the first rudy kit and all three of the boxes from that person's second rudy kit and i'm going to be opening them before i do um as we kind of get cracking and observe this damaged box um i just want to kind of mention that i'm going to be doing an alpha box opening at the courtesan cup so i'm really excited about this and uh really excited to you know participate and 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 get in on that um this is interesting uh that's really interesting um, so if you want to participate in that with me, you can buy packs as in terms of, you know, slots of that opening. And I'm going to be opening it live on the Cordis and Cups live stream, probably on Saturday night. Um, so reach out to me if you're interested. I'm going to be selling packs under market price shipped, under market price shipped. I'm targeting the $45 to $50 range per pack, depending on what I can get the box at. Uh, so please reach out if you're interested. I I'm kind of curious to see, do we have 36 packs here? Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12. Okay. Do we have an extra in here? Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 13. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 11. Okay. So it looks like one pack slid over. We're just going to kind of do it that way. So... Yes, reach out to me if you are interested. Um, I'm excited for it. Depending on how many sell, and if you're at the Courtesan Cup, you can take your cards right there, or, or I'll ship them to you. Buried Treasure, Felborg, and the Royal Guard here. Okay, so we got Boil, Entangle, Little Beast, Wall, Link, Grapple. And um, I'm going to be sleeving up everything that's exceptional and higher on that. You know, obviously because a lot of those things are, you know, collector's pieces and such. We got the Torshimer, we got the Digging Team, and we got some Scorched Earth. Okay, hey, Blizzard. So, I've been seeing a lot of Rudy ship boxes, those, uh, you know, bundles. And I've been noticing what I feel to be... A disproportionate number of interesting things coming out of that so I, I, I don't know I, it just feels like those boxes are really good and I, I bought up a bunch I bought Rudy promo myself I, whoa see this is what I'm talking about this is a Rudy promo box right here right from the first bundle so let's take a moment and uh, look at this amethyst core holy cow oh my god uh, what an excellent piece what an excellent piece uh, that's our first unique, and uh, we'll just kind of set it back there. Um, I'm running, I think I'm going to run a Battle Mage deck at the Courtesan Cup. I actually thought about, like, seeing, like, hey, should I be a vendor there? And, like, you know, buy list cards off of folks, sell some things, but I kind of want to play in it, to be honest. So, uh, because of that... I'm gonna play and not and not be a vendor in the future. I may I may be a vendor selling singles um, at events and uh, buying cards from folks. Um, you know, I, I really want to. Um, you know, I offer a lot of different TCGs that I do openings for, but I really want to make sorcery that number one for me in terms of the the main product I'm for focusing on. It becomes a little hard with one release a year, I'm not going to lie, especially if you want to specialize in a product, um, So, which is why I, I do do multiple openings, but sorcery, for me, is my favorite, and um, that's what I, I'd like to continue with long term. Um, I do hold a full foil beta set. Um, I did finally finish that off just shortly after um, it was announced that you know, Team Covenant went out of stock. So, and, uh, nice remote desert. I have at least nine Rudy boxes coming in. Undyne. Dodge roll and nice elementalist. All right, we'd love to see that in foil. Men of Lang, first foil. Okay. 
Excellent. Excellent men. Amethyst cores, you know, I don't do prices anymore. Um, just because the boxes are out of stock MSRP and, and for for me I'm not I'm not doing that right now. But an amethyst core is going for around a hundred. But at the moment. Maybe a little more. Arid Desert. Now, will it be the misprint Arid Desert? Boom! And it is not the misprint. Arid Desert misprint is upside down. So this one is right side up, and it's not the misprint. That's okay. I've actually pulled more misprint foil Arid Deserts than I have anything else. List them. Hey, little spider. David. Okay, an ancient dragon. Scarecrow. Critical strike. Oh boy. What what fortune? Holy cow, a lone tower foil. <laughs> this is incredible, folks. Um I I want this for my uh, battle mage deck. We want full foil. We want a full foil deck going in. Right? Beautiful. Gothic Tower is a little more on the rare side, sitting at around forty dollars right now. Lone Tower, you know, I, I'm actually not quite sure what it's doing, but I, my guess is it's between ten to twenty at the moment. Purge. Okay, we got the zombies. Beasts. Oh, nice foil outback. Little outback strider. Okay. Yeah, like I said, email me, philosophercards.gmail.com. You want to get in on that alpha opening. Um, like I said, it's a great time to do it because I'm, I'm going to get you in under uh, under market and you're physically watching that box being open, right? Um, which, when you're dealing with packs of that cost, um, this is really dark looking. Look how dark that looks. Uh, it's always a, a crapshoot buying single packs, especially at that price. So buying it from me is a good opportunity to make sure that you have uh, the best chance at, at pulling something. Got some folks already lined up, so um, you know, make sure you reach out. Spire Lich, okay. And an occult ritual coming in for the second unique. Okay. Wall of Ice. Trojan. That one felt really thick. Okay. Man, Amethyst Core. Boom. Lighthouse coming in. Shifting Sands. Season Cell Sword. That one's really off cut. You can see how slanted that is there. Spectral. Some of these cards are kind of like a movie where you rewatch it and you just keep noticing new things in the in the movie or in the artwork. Like I feel like every time I look at this stuff, I'm I'm seeing the art just a little bit different. Make no mistake, sorcery has the best artwork in it's an onyx core. <laughs> Ooh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Onyx cores are hard to pull. Right? Hard to pull. Onyx core, in my mind, is the hardest to pull of all the cores. Followed close second in a close second by the Aqua Core. Close second. Can we get all the cores in one box? Is that possible? Should we search for a box that does that? Backstab foil backstab would be great. That's our second elementalist in this box, which is kind of crazy to me. That last box that we opened had three battle mages in it though, so. I mean, I guess anything's possible. See, Sam, every time I look at that, it's like it's like I see something different.
Flaming Sword, Phase Assassin, Boom, Wind Sif, and a Black Cobelisk. Okay, hey, Gravel Shot, love to see a Grapple Shot in Foil. Common Sense. Okay. These Rudy boxes, I'm telling you guys. Fireball. Mix Aqua. Boom. Mix Aqua. It's a great pull. Pilgrim. Infiltrate. Solid card. Quicker. Trojan. Sandstorm. And a Lone Tower. Bannerman. Yeah. Battle. Okay, a nice Puppet Master. I think that's the second Puppet Master of this video. Okay. Ruins. Nice. Nice dual sight. Sea Raider. Okay. Immortal Throne coming in for our fourth unique. Okay. Immortal Throne feels like it could be a pretty powerful deck. I haven't seen anybody do it right yet. But it feels like it could be something. Aqueduct. Nice. Another dual. Mother Nature coming in for number five. Five on Mother Nature. Tenvale. Okay. Five more foils, too. We could have maybe two to three more uniques, depending. And uh, five more foils. Okay, we got a watchtower, and we got the ruler of Thule coming in for number six unique. See how they're clumped, though? All those uniques are clumped right there. Give us something good. Foil, come on. Wrong. Miracle workers. Okay. Windblast. Pikeman. Little clamor. Cell Sword. Landsman. Harpooners. And boom, Undertaker Engine. Okay. Blood Ravens, some Scarabs, the Wizard. Man, we've gone the whole second row here with no foils. This one might be a foil, though. Mummies. Eagle. Full demons. Really dark, dark print on this pack here. Very cauldron crowns. Turtles. No. All the foils are going to be in... This feels like something's weird with this one. This this pack feels weird. This is the one that was slid over, right? What do we got? What do we got? Sea Raider. Kraken. Okay, nothing. Crazy. We're still missing five foils. Magellan Globe, okay. Okay. If you guys haven't seen that, the ladies promo from Rudy, it is one of the most beautiful cards I've ever seen. 
So if you don't have a copy of it, you know, maybe you'll get to be able to see it. Um, but it is, it's a stunning card. I mean, really, really stunning. Are we going to be clumped at the bottom with all these foils? What's going on here? What's going on? Are we not going to keep, are we not getting our allotment of foils? I mean, I guess we got two cores, so who's to, who's to complain? Druids? The bears? Look at the, the colors on that just look really dark. Pikeman. Planar Gate. One day that might be something. Muse, Overpower, Bolt. Jeez. No foil. We're coming down to like five packs left. I feel like we're just going to hit straight foils for the rest of the video. Shark, Clamor, Backstab, Pendulum is our number seventh unique. Okay. Here we go. Wave Shaper. Boom. What a beautiful foil. I mean, anytime you get an avatar, you say thank you. That's it. Not, no questions asked. Nothing else. It's a foil avatar. Let me tell you, people are going to want to play with these. They're going to want to buy these, right? I have not sold any foil avatars, and I don't plan to. And the reasoning is, is because when... That, when sorcery takes off and, and you see double the amount of players triple the amount of players everyone's going to want to get their hands on a wave shaper and you can only get the wave shaper in beta you can't get an alpha wave shaper so that goes in our pile of wins number five and that's what that is so this box was definitely a win so far nice step uh far east assassin i'd love to see the curio version Air, Serpent, Fenvale, Muse, Lightning. Man. I think we got like five packs left with four foils to go. Okay, we got foil. All right, all right, all right. Wasn't trusting the process here. Things were throwing me off. Step. We got a nice amount of dual lands in this too. And two infiltrates, which infiltrates are always a good thing to see. Blink. Rain of arrows. Oh, boom. Crater eyes. Okay. Take it. It's our elite. Nice board wipe card. Play that in conjunction with roots. Play that in the conjunction with a couple other things. You know? It's a good time. Autumn unicorn. We got the giant shark. We got the shield wall. Oh, polar explorers. All right. The warriors. Swans. Oh, we got another site coming in. It's a remote desert. Look at how clean that looks. Man, that look that just looks clean. Bone Ravel Spark Mage. Beautiful. Again, people are gonna want foil sites. They're gonna want foil sites. They're gonna want foil avatars. That looks clean. Absolutely beautiful. Two more foils to go, I believe. I do believe. Dodge roll. Okay, Manthacore. We got a Heat Ray. Generate. Oh, ho, 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 another you sight. Holy cow, with another little rubble. Holy cow, it's another sight. Jeez. Rustic Village. I mean, all these sites, you know, you're looking 10 to 20 bucks per foil. Boom. 10 to 20 bucks. Each foil. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, two packs left, one foil to go. Yeah, two packs left. Master Tracker? Okay. Windsliff. Okay. Really don't pull don't pull her too often Talk about a nice beautiful foil and card holy cow is that beautiful 
Holy cow. Well, that'll do it. Belfry. Scarabs, the Lang. Thanks for tuning in. Remember, if you want an alpha opening, reach out to me. Bossercards at gmail.com. Get in on it. Portison Cup. Alpha. Thanks for watching. Actually, let's show you guys the cores real quick. Beautiful. Beautiful wins on that box. Wow. Talk to y'all later.